Hey guys, I'm Boot. We're in New Jersey, and today we are going to do an in-car review of one of the new McDonald's worldwide favorites. This is the Mick Extreme Bacon. Uh, bacon. <laughs> yeah. I don't know what it is. I guess it's just a bacon it's burger. It's part of their worldwide favorites. Okay, yeah, right so, off the bat you can see the uh, the Gouda, the bacon. Yeah, it doesn't look very appetizing. Onions and yeah. that sauce again. Let me get a little swipe of that sauce. I want to see something. Okay, it's actually the smoky something sauce. Bacon. It's the same one that's on the um, the other one. What that other chicken one? sandwich. It is? Yeah. Like double handle that bitch. <laughs> it's huge. It's a, yeah, it's huge. Alright. It's it's really, really salty. Um the bacon flavor is really strong. Um again it's okay. I'm not really impressed. I don't think this would be my new go-to favorite thing. Um, I know these are like a limited time only thing. Yeah, I think um, the bacon is very strong and that smoky, whatever it is, sauce. Um, I don't know why I keep saying smoky and everything, but it is kind of like a barbecued called. smoky flavor. It's a smoky bacon sauce, they say. Oh, okay. There's a good amount of bacon on this. I'll give it that. Uh, usually you get the burgers with bacon and they don't have that much bacon on them. I, I think the bacon flavor is very strong. I guess that's why it's the extreme bacon. I don't know why they extreme why they mick extremed it. It's from Spain. Oh, okay. And it has Gouda cheese is on the top and bottom of the burger. Then it has a smoky bacon sauce, slivered onions, and an uh, applewood smoked bacon on a sesame seed bun. Okay. So that sounds pretty good. Um, I think everything in it I liked. The uh, onions, I wish they would do more with the onions. I wish it wasn't such a regular onion taste. Maybe like a, um, like a cooked onion. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? I think uh, a cooked onion is a lot better. I, I just don't I think it translates well. I don't know what makes it Mick Extreme because the only thing you could taste is bacon. So I guess it's an extreme bacon flavor. I think it's just off the other menu, as the menu from Spain. I think that's a, an interesting take, but I think something gets lost in translation when these things come over to America from other countries. Yeah, that's because in other countries they use real food. If you try this in the country it's from, it probably tastes a thousand times better. Anyways. Uh, I think I would give it a four out of five. I, I did enjoy it. Um, it's very salty. But um, I, th I think it's it's a good burger. Yeah, I think I would give it a four out of five too. I like the gouda. I, I, I thought it was good. The only thing I didn't like was that it was so bacon heavy flavored, and it, there really isn't a whole lot of bacon on it. Maybe like two strips of bacon. Mm -hmm. um, maybe it's because it's applewood smoked bacon, and it goes with the sauce that makes it like very bacon flavored. Yeah. Tell us in the comments if you tried it or if you tried any of the worldwide favorites. Let us know what you thought in the comment section below. Absolutely. And if there's Even anything. You never do. Yeah, you never do. But if there's anything else you want us to review, let us know and we'll try to review it next. Right. So anyways, thank you guys for liking, commenting, and subscribing. We will see you guys in the next one. And stay tuned because we're going to be doing the Stroopwafel McFlurry. Sounds good. Mm. Okay, guys. Bye. Bye.